we're back. All I can really say is murder and mayhem. Uh, I mean, it's been accidental, but it's still murder, isn't it? I don't know. Anyways, we're back. We are playing this crazy game called Mountain Crime. And I'm your Gibbs. If you look at our inventory here, we have our room key, 206. Actually, it's not our room key. It is a room key. We have a doll, which we need to put over here somehow. Newspaper and another doll. Two dolls. But anyways, let's find out what the mysteries are behind door number 206. I like how this is blue, this is yellow, and that's purple. Oh my god, who's hanging there? Holy cow, what is going on here? Oh, that's just... creepy. It's a mannequin, why does it have a timer on it? It's a device of some kind and it's missing a part, but it's counting down. Holy cow, that's making me nervous. Okay. I recognize these places. Someone has a good eye for detail. Okay. Oh, it's our room. Why would there be a miniature? Remember the bathroom? Or, I mean, the shower? Wow. Okay, thank God this is just a mannequin. Those colored wires bother me though. Is this actually a bomb? Oh yeah, it does have colored wires, doesn't it? Oh, it's a scorpion. <laughs> a pair of scorpions are hanging out in there. Shh, this place is like super dangerous. So I'm not sure what else we can do here. Oh, it looks like we're supposed to be doing something here. I don't even know. Dolls. Hang the dolls up. Huh. That must be me. Someone knew there was a doctor in the house. But I don't have any more doc or any more dolls, though. Alright, let's, uh, there was someone... Wasn't there a something needing a scale? I can remember now. Oh, maybe it was back here. Yeah, oh, look, there's our sergeant. Jack, where have you been? Catherine has died. She was dead when I returned to her room. I believe someone poisoned her with cyanide. Either that or she committed suicide because you caught her trying to destroy evidence. I don't think so. I believe the opposite was true. She wanted us to free her so she could prove her innocence. Did you call the police? Yes, I did. When the police get here, they'll figure everything out. Until then, let's seal off the second floor. Okay. How are we supposed to seal off the second floor? Go this way. So I'm still not exactly sure I'm supposed to open that up. Let's go inside my own room. Ah, yes, there's where the scale needs to go. Hey, another doll. That's the sergeant. Alright, let's do the cool hidden object scene. Now we're looking for some nuts and bolts and springs and all sorts of goodies. So, let's try and get this done here. Oh, I see we're fixing the uh, the bird here. Why is the name of that bird escaping me? I want to say pelican, but that's not right. The one with all the pretty feather feathers in it. Peacock! <laughs> there you go, peacock. We are totally fixing the peacock. That's not an item? No, I guess not. There's our spring. Oil can. So we have a gear and some bolts. So we just need the gear and we are good to go. If I was a gear, where would I be? Good question. I would be over there apparently. So what is this supposed to do by fixing the peacock? Whoa, it just flashed its bum at us. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now we have a magnet and a string. Ah, maybe that will 
allow us to bypass these scorpions so that we can get these pliers. And then we can open the cage with the two birds in it. Actually, I'm kind of curious. Is that actually counting? 3155. Five. Hmm. Let's see if I can remember that. Alright, let's open this up. We need the doll here, anyways. If I try to take the doll out of there, that bird will peck my hand. You're gonna swat it with a newspaper. Ooh. Maybe not. <laughs> Silly bird. What about this one? Ah, oh, maybe we'll just uh, give it a bird buddy. That f oh, the body is, is supposed to be disappeared? Or is it just my imagination? I don't remember it disappearing. Here, here's your bird buddy. There, now you're lovebirds. So we have another doll. The dollhouse is coming together now. Hey, there's the journalist. Unbelievable! Seriously. What madness is this? The puppets just performed everything that happened up to this point. That's impossible. I agree. Do we have this bit? Is this how many bits do we need? I don't really think we need one. Okay, click on the arrows to move the tiles. Your goal is to match the drawing. When you click on an arrow, the entire row or column moves. Ooh. Huh. Interesting. So how do I get that out of there? Good question. I don't see how we're supposed to do this. Hmm. No, so that's not going to help me at all. Okay, so now we need the blue one to go down there. This is kind of crazy, by the way. It only lets me go there, does it? I guess these gray ones have to go in the middle, right? And this blue one, too. Hmm. So how do I get the... This red one needs to go here. Okay, cool. And then we need to get green one over there somehow. Uh, actually, this might work, folks. Haha! -ha. No, but I want the yellow one to be there. So now, the question is, how do I get this one back? It needs to go down there. I need to get this yellow one out of here. No, it does that not work? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what if I do this? Okay, so we still need to get this one out of there, though. Oh, shoot. I think I might have made things worse. So how do I get this out of here? Oh, oh, that's good. That's good. I only have one more to go. Wow, look at that. So how am I supposed to do this one? I need to get that one over there. But I can't get in between there yet. Uh, 
Hmm. Not sure how that's going to help me. Wow, I can move that all the way over there. How does that help me? I don't think it does help me, actually. I guess I move that down. Pull that over. So now how do I get this one out of here? Okay. Well, it's still not doing it. Now we're just screwing this up even worse. Ha <laughs> ha Now I gotta switch these two around. Holy cow, this is kinda insane. So how does this help me at all? I really need to get this green one back. It'd be nice if I could get it over there somehow. Okay, so that helps us there, I think, but I've, re I've really made a mess of this. I have totally made a mess of this. Green one could go there though. Purple one needs to go up there. Blue one needs to go down. Hmm. So how am I supposed to do this? Shoot. How do I get that purple one there? I so want it to be there. Okay, so that might help me. That's good. I need to get this blue one down now. Um, oh, that actually might turn out pretty well, pretty good. I go that there, that goes there, that goes there. But I still need to get this purple one over here now. If I Do this and move this out. Move that back. Oh, ho, ho, ho. now I. Oh, it worked! I'm not exactly sure how that worked, but I'll take that. And now it's racing to zero. Whoa, it sounded like something blew up on the third floor. I better go see if anyone's hurt. Holy cow, okay, that startled me. What was that? Oh, the bird saw. We're having a cool time. Hello? Who's this guy? Cool dude. I don't know what his name is. Hello, my friends. This is nasty weather we're having. Uh, hello. We haven't met. Did you just arrive? Do you know where Mr. Gray is? I arrived a few hours ago. Mr. Gray sent me an invitation to the grand opening of this hotel. That's why I'm here. My name is Nick Stone. Jack Scargan, I'm the sheriff in these parts, and I'd like to ask you a couple of questions. Let's start with where you've been for the last half hour. Why do I have to tell you? Where I've been is my business, not yours. Listen up. 
Two people have died in this hotel in the last 30 minutes. Talk like that is an express ticket to prison. Nick, this situation is serious, and your stubbornness is only going to get you in trouble. People have died in this hotel? Are you serious? Two guests have died. Someone appears to have poisoned Catherine Miller with cyanide, and Kevin Taylor died from a snake bite. Things are getting complicated. Wow. Certainly smells like trouble. I arrived a few hours ago, and when I got to my room, I found a note that said someone was waiting near the pavilion to talk with me. I went to the pavilion and waited for an hour, but no one showed up. As I was walking back to the hotel, I heard the blast. Something blew up on the third floor, but we can't get there to see what happened because the elevator is broken, and the stairs only go up to the second floor. The elevator was always breaking. Old Tom would curse up a storm every time he had to fix it. You've been here before? Yep. About 20 years ago, this place used to be a children's resort. I lived here right before the fire, which happened in the late 80s. That was a good time in my life. I used to use the workshop out back. You might be able to find some tools there. The door to the backyard is locked, but I found part of the lock on the porch. Here, you can have it. You stayed here before the fire? Interesting. Uh, Philip, I'll stay here and uh, keep an eye on Nick while you fix the elevator. <laughs> I gotta do all that work. Fine, fine, another puzzle. All right, let's see what we have to do with this one. So, what are my instructions here? What does this mean? Oh. Do I have an ability to... How does this even work? That's green and yellow. That's blue and red. So we need green and blue. Okay, so I just gotta rotate it? That's not bad. I can live with that. I can totally live with that. Except this one doesn't work. Oh, oh, there it goes. So that one needs to rotate around. That one should be red. That one there needs to be yellow. Yellow, red, blue, and then this one. That's it? That's all it took? Alright, sure. Let's go with that. This back here is a little on the creepy side. What the heck is going on in here? All I have is a newspaper right now, folks. There's something under the grate, but I can't get it out. Well, let's go inside the work shed. Got myself a winch. Uh, the latches are too rusty. Looks like we can make a horse. Mix clay. Coals are barely glowing. Blowing air on them would help. Alright, it looks like we gotta fix some engine here. That's cool. I'll deal with that. That sounds like a neat endeavor. Direction, I'm not entirely sure. I think we're fixing the motor. So what else do we need? We need a grinding wheel, looks like. Grinding wheel. Bolt. A wrench and a plug. Hmm. There's a wrench. Look at the old cash register just laying here too. No, oh, there's a number there, huh? So a grinding wheel and a power plug. There's the power plug. There's the grinding wheel. Oh, it's, we actually did make a grinding wheel. Okay, so we're going to have to sharpen something. Oh, we're sharpening the hedge cutters. Thank you. I'll definitely take those. What's down here? I can't reach that package. Looks like we need a hook for that. Uh, what else can we do? Uh, okay. Hmm, the door's locked with a hook, and I don't think anyone is going to unhook it for me, so I'll have to do it on my own. So, I don't see anything there. We'll go forward. Well, it looks like we're at the stables here. This, 
That trough is full of holes. The water pours right through it. Okay. I don't like horses and they don't like me. Look at all these prices. The werewolf shelter stable? Okay. Uh, what do we have here? I have no idea what I'm doing here. It would take me forever to guess the code. Maybe I'll find it somewhere. Yeah, maybe. Alright, well, I think we're going to have to back out of here because we're out of time, but we'll be back very soon for more Mountain Crime. Thanks for watching, everyone.